Hey, this is Robbie Frank, and in this video, I'm going to show you a concept which I call the income flowchart, which will allow you to track your income, make sure that you create multiple sources of income, and make sure you increase it every single month. Now, if you don't have five minutes or 10 minutes to sit down and listen to this explanation, actually soak it up and take action on it, then this video is not for you. You should probably move on. But if you do have those time, this time and this focus, this video will change your financial reality. So the income flow chart, very, very simple. Income flow chart. The way it looks is I divide my income into months. So let's say April and May. And I also like to have a total. Now, what I do is I write down all of my income sources. So let's say main business, side business, book sales, lecturing, coaching, and so on and so forth. I basically write down every single thing that gives me income, including investing, including the um, residual income that I get just from having money in a bank or in an investment vehicle. So everything gets written down here. Every single thing that makes me have more money, that brings in money. And the way I write down is, let's say on April, I got 15K from the main business. And in May, I got 18K. Let's say that the side business brought in an extra two and a half thousand. And the next month it brought in an extra three and a half thousand. So basically I, I write down all of the difference, all of the different incomes uh, from each month per the, the thing that brought in the income. And then what I do is I update this roughly once a week and make sure that I'm on track. And the, the key here is that this, this chart shows me the total. So how much in total from all of these combined, how much in total from all of these combined and I sorted, the way I sort the, the chart is based on which one brought in the most so that I always know at the top to see the one brought in the most and then the second, then third, and how much, again, total income that income flow brought me. And then what I do on the right is I set a target. And then next to it, what I call a gap. So a target means what am I aiming for in this month. So to give you a more accurate example, the way it would look is, let's say, again, this is, <clears throat> sorry, this is May. So May, we're in May right now. Yeah, so this is perfect. So in May, let's say up to this point, I brought in um, $1,000 from this, from the side business, and $10,000 from the main business. Now, the reason this is smaller than this is because this is the right now we're in the 10th of May. So it's only getting there. It's not we're not at the end of the month. So that's why I update it every week. Now, if you actually uh, set a target, then what I do is I look at the total income that I want to get to that month. And let's say that I made 15,000 in April from the side from the main business. I want to make this month an extra 20 thousand total. So I want to make total 20,000 in May. And let's say that I made two and a half thousand in April. I want to make in May three and a half thousand. So this is my target. Again, this is the current month. Again, the, this, this already happened. It doesn't matter anymore. This is the past. This is retroactive records. This is what current, what's currently happening. This is the current month. Now the target is for this month in the gap is basically how much do I have to get more of from this and how much more from this, how much more from this to get to my target. So in here, the gap is obviously 10,000 because I want to get to 20, I'm at 10. Because Why do I want to get to 20? Because I got to 15 the month before. I'm increasing income. And here, I got to 2.5 last month. Now I want to get to 3.5, I'm at one. So the gap is uh, 2.5. Now, next to each gap, what I do is I write a plan. So for each of these gaps, 
what I do is I write a, a plan to how I am going to achieve that, to how am I going, how am I going to close that gap? And I make sure that I set a plan that I'm actually going to go for. So no plan is, uh, impossible. Every single goal you can get to in your life. The question is, are you willing to take the risk, put in the time, put in the effort to make it happen, to actually focus enough to get working? So what I do when I set my targets and I see the gap and I see how much I have left, I always ask myself, am I actually going to make this happen? Am I actually going to create a plan to guarantee that I get there? And if not, I just lower the target. You know, I don't take it as a, as a, a bad sign and just say, okay, I can clearly see I'm not going to take the 10x actions to get there. So I'll just lower the target and I'm going to go for something that I can commit to because targets are important. When you set a target, you have to get to it no matter what at any cost. So this is the, this is pretty much it. The, again, the income sources, I write down every single income source. How much did I get from in total from all the months from this income source? And then last month and then this month. And then what is my target for this month? And what's the gap from where I am right now? And update it every single week and then set a goal, a plan to get to basically clear that gap. So this is the flow chart. This is the income flow chart. Sorry. And this is the tool that I've been using for the past half year to greatly increase my income, multiply it every single month, add at least 30% to my income every single month. And it works amazing because whatever you put your attention on grows. And if you're not going to pay attention to your income sources, if you don't put your focus on them and don't pay attention, don't validate them, then it's just going to go away. They're just going to disappear. So I've put in this link below uh, the actual flow, income flow chart. You can actually use it for yourself, just click on it. It's a Google Drive document. All you need to do is go to file and make a copy, and then you're gonna have your own copy where you can put in the information and start working with it for yourself. So thank you for watching this video. Let me know if you have any questions and I'd love to help you. I offer coaching and I sell my own book which details my life story. You can click on the links below and check it out. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.